Nosebleeds are a common problem for which patients get seen by an ear, nose, and throat doctor. In this particular patient, she has been having recurrent nosebleeds several times a week for the past few months. The nose is carefully examined to find a source of the nosebleed. In some patients, there is a vascular knuckle that can erupt causing a spurting type of nosebleed. In others, there are superficial blood vessels that can lead to an oozing or drippy type of nosebleed. Before cauterization, the nose is anesthetized using a cotton ball soaked with lidocaine. After a short period of time, cauterization can commence. The most common type of cauterization is using a silver nitrate stick. When applied to the nasal surface, nitric acid is formed that causes a chemical burn turning the area brownish white. However, in certain situations when the blood vessel is large, a much deeper cauterization is required using electricity. Bipolar cauterization is shown here whereby an electric current is passed between the metal prongs burning the tissue not only at the surface but underneath as well. It takes about two weeks for the area to completely heal.